lap band is a much less invasive procedure that can be done now through what most of the people in the audience refer to as laser surgery, but it's really right. laparoscopic surgery, where they make a very tiny hole, right? And they can go in and they can place literally a belt around a part of the stomach to make sure that there's only a small amount of the stomach that the food gets into, and then you get full very quickly. And that belt can be adjusted without having to cut the patient open from time to time. Now, I, I mean, I'm, you're sitting here saying, why wasn't that available <laughs> when I was yeah. there? Is this something that you would, knowing what you know now, that I would have, mind? I would have jumped at the opportunity because, you know, with the gastric bypass surgery, you have situations where um, a part of my intestine has been removed where I would have absorbed, naturally absorbed right. certain vitamins. Right. So vitamin B12 is something I'll have to have, you right. know, injections the, the rest, rest of my of life. life. Right. I have to be followed by a physician who's very knowledgeable right. in nutrition right. and, and, and the whole gastric bypass procedures. Right. Right. And we're still learning, you know, we're right. not far enough out right. to, in, in study to right. see, you know, what the long-term effects of this is of too. The, the, so, the earlier forms of gastric correct. bypass. Correct. Correct. Yeah, and I think that just for the, again, to help the audience understand what we're talking about here are some of the challenges with the earlier form of gastric bypass, sure. which is called the Ruin Y or the Fovey bypass, mm -hmm. where actually a, a, a significant section of your stomach was taken out of the normal physiologic oh. process, yes. right? And the food bypassed that. That's why it was called a bypass. And so a lot of your vitamins were not absorbed, a lot of your minerals were not absorbed as well as they should and had to be supplemented. That's and this correct. is what you were saying. Yes. And so you're right, the, in those cases, they really need to be followed. Now, the, the lap band actually um, avoids some of that because the food actually doesn't go back through the, the regular stomach. Right, there, right, there's nothing removed or stapled off or right. sutured off. Right. So. And you're really right. playing yeah. with the physiology of the actual stomach where it sends that signal back up to the brain that says, I'm full. Right, <laughs> right, right. It, it, yeah. You have to develop a relationship with your physician and see what is best for you at that time. And, and, and surely I believe that all physicians would agree right. that the least invasive procedure that right. would reach the same goal would right. be the best right. way to go.